Hi you guys, it's Allison and I'm here with my November favorites and Okay, I just used new shampoo and it literally shrunk my hair. Like I'm just kidding. I totally paid someone to cut all my hair off. And I love it. I think it's so cute. It's so me. I've had long hair forever. So I just think that it is okay that I have short hair now. So we're going to get into my November favorites. I don't even know if any of these are from Sephora, but it is going to happen. And we are going to go through these. I think there's six of them. I feel like you're supposed to do five, but it's my channel and I can do what I want. Let's get started. Okay. Okay, so we're going to start with... We're going to start with this Too Faced Chocolate Bronzer. That does smell like chocolate. It smells so much like chocolate. It's so good. And just to let you know, it does taste like chocolate. I didn't eat it on purpose. But when your mouth open, when you put it on your bronzer, you get a little in your mouth. And yes, it does taste like um, I have had this product since March. It is now November, and I am telling you, I have not even touched the bottom. I use this pretty much every single day. I don't ever use a different bronzer. Completely in love with this one. Don't want to change. Don't seem like I want to change. Don't see myself in the future wanting to change, because I'm in love with this product. I'm telling you, it is so good. I'm sure there's amazing products out there, but right now, I am completely and still in love with this product, and... I mean, I'm down to try something new, but I'm really in love with this product. Um, and I also use the medium deep shade, if you wanted to know. Okay, next we're going to do another Too Faced, and this is the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I love this color. I love the packaging. I love the formula. I love the product. I love the wand. Look at this. It's so nice. It's perfect. I've had this for a long time. Actually, no, I've not had this. I've been using this product for a long time. This is my third bottle that I've used. I try other mascaras. Don't get me wrong. I'm a little more open than the bronzer. I try thousands of mascaras. My Ipsy bag always has new mascaras. And this is just the one that I'm completely in love with. Yes, I have tried the waterproof one. No, I do not like it. I don't love it. I have. I use it... I use it sometimes, but I put this on first and then cover the waterproof with it. But it stays wet. It doesn't dry. It doesn't... I feel like the formula is too wet. I honestly... I don't like it. I do own it. I do try it. The packaging is beautiful. The packaging is so beautiful. Do not get me wrong. I'm so in love with the packaging, but it's just not for me. You guys might like it. I just personally don't like it. But the regular one, count me in. I'm so in love with it. I love everything about it. Huh. But I love it. Don't get me wrong. Sorry, I was reading a little bottom. Okay, my next products, we're going to be doing the Marc Anthony True Professional Second Clear Dry Shampoo. So, real quick story. Um, I really don't have greasy hair. I usually... I don't know. I usually don't use dry shampoos. But about six months ago, I got this at Rite Aid. I was comparing if I wanted to get this one or the Not Your Mother's Dry Shampoo. But this was a super good deal. It was buy one, get one half off. So me and my friend each picked one up. We like split the cost or whatever. And I'm telling you, product is amazing. It's so good. I love it. The packaging is so cute. And the product is just amazing. And it really works. I have tried a Dove one. And I do like this one. I think this one smells better. I don't know. I mean, none of them smell bad, but I just like this one. It keeps my hair. I feel like my hair is, like, literally straight out of the shower. I feel like it looks so nice. And I just love that the results that this product gets. Now we're going to do... We'll do this one. Okay, so this is the Maybelline New York Fit Me du Dewy Plus Smooth normal to dry foundation and I am in the shade 130 and I completely love it this is my second model I've been on 
I was using the Pro Long Foundation from MAC. Um, I really did like that one, but I love this one. It's my favorite drugstore foundation as of right now. Um, I do want to try a new foundation. I am so open to foundations. If you guys have a really, if you guys have a foundation that's really good for dry skin, like dry skin, like desert dry skin, please hit me up and let me know because comment below and tell me what it is and I will literally try it. I need to try a new foundation. This one works great, but I'm ready to venture out a little bit. I mean, nothing's really wrong with this one. It works great. I love the results, but I'm just ready for something new. Uh, it is my favorite foundation this month. And I will continue looking, using this until I am done looking for a new one. But as of right now, favorite foundation. So I'm just going to be doing a makeup wipe. I am in love with the Cream Shop Pink Lemonade Cleaning Towels with Vitamin C with 30 wipes in each one. I buy these from Styles for Less. Styles for Less is a 3 for 5 and these are there and I get them. And I have used expensive, expensive wipes. I've had Costco wipes. But these are my favorite wipes. You get three for five, so you get 90 wipes for $5. And I'm telling you, you can use one to get all your makeup off. They work so good. I'm telling you, they work amazing. Get them. Use them. Love them. Like, they work good. They work so good. I love them. And last but not least, um, I am going to do a review on the Illuminate by Ashley Tisdale. This is the Beach Goddess palette, I believe that's what it's called. If not, I will put what it's actually called, but I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. Um, this is what the product looks like, and I keep a little plastic on it just so I know the names of them, because I think the names are so cute. And um, this is what it looks like. And there's 12 different colors. That's what it says, yeah. 12 different colors, eyes, and cheek collection. And I'm so in love with that. I will swatch one of them for you. This is the swatch. I'm telling you, it is so nice. And so, thumbs up. Thumbs up for this product. Um, this one right here was the St. Bart's. St. St. S. St. Bart's, probably saying this wrong, I'm probably sounding real stupid, but it's okay because I love this product. I love Ashley Tisdale for sure, and this product is just amazing. I'm so glad I bought it. It's so affordable. I'm going to take one of these amazing makeup wipes and get this off so I can show you how good these makeup wipes work. Bam. All gone. Two thumbs up. But, I am completely in love with this product, super affordable, I got makeup all over my bed, I really should stop doing that, but I love the product, the packaging is amazing, and I am honestly in love with the product. That is it for um, my November favorites, I know there are six, I'm sorry, I just couldn't decide, all six of these are products that I cannot live without with. Pretty sure that was said wrong. But this November, I have been obsessed with those products. So, yeah, I'm so down. So, I'm going to be doing a couple questions just to um, let you know me a little bit better. Um, so, I'm just going to tell you about myself. So, I hope you enjoyed that. And now we're going to get into this sec part of the second. This part of the video. We're going to get into this part of the video. So, my name of course is Allison, and I don't know if you know that, but you do now. Um, I am a senior in high school this year. Do not ask me where I'm going to school or what I want to be, because I don't know. No idea. I thought I wanted to be a nurse, and then I was like, nah. And then I was like, I'll be a teacher, and then I was like, hmm. So now I'm going to square back of zero with no idea what I want to do. I have lots of uh, ideas, but... I don't know. We'll see what happens. We will see what happens. I have a little more time to decide, so we'll see. Um, I am 17. I don't know if I just said that, but I'm 17. Next question. Okay, so why I started my YouTube channel was a huge question that a lot of people asked me. So I'm going to make a long story real short. Um, I was going through some friend things, and I was just trying to find a new way to just kind of 
I don't know, just put myself out there. And my boyfriend was telling me that I need to put myself out there, so I was like, you know what, I'm going to put myself out there. Knowing that it could be a really big risk, I don't like usually putting myself out there. I'm pretty content with keeping to myself. And even though I'm a really outgoing person, I just kind of like don't want to put myself out there because then people can say stuff. But you know, I was like, I need to take a risk and I need to do this. So I started my video videos and honestly life has been going really good. I obviously only have like 35 subscribers, but that's a lot for me. I mean, I just started and I'm really happy and I know that... I don't know, I've met a lot of people that I went to school with that I didn't even know. And they're like, i seen your video and now we talk all the time. And I think it's so cool. And um, I just want to thank everyone for the support. And I just think it's super cool that you guys are all here with me um, going through this. And I hope one day my channel gets so big and I'm like, these right here, these are the people that stuck with me through the whole thing. So I just want to thank you guys for your support and your views and your likes and comments. So um, my next question is, why is my name Barbie Ann? 144. So I'm gonna break up the thing. Of course, the first name is Barbie. I love Barbies. Like I love Barbie. I don't want to. I don't want to play with dolls, obviously. But like, my phone case is Barbie, and I have a, like, I have sweaters and T-shirts and uh, makeup bags and tissues. I have tissue Barbie. I don't know why, but I do. I bought them. I have a toothbrush that says Barbie on it. I'm really weird, I guess you could say, but I am completely I'm just kind of weird but I'm completely in love with Barbie so that's where Barbie came from um Anne is my middle name so it's Allison Ann Anne's my middle name and um the 144 it was supposed to be 14 because 14 is my favorite number but that was already taken on Instagram so I just threw in another four in there because I was like why not so that is how Barbie Ann 144 came about and the last question I have is, what is my favorite memory that I have in high school so far? Because I'm not done yet. We got some, some big events coming up. But as of right now, my favorite event is um, when I was a sophomore, I was in the play Grease. And um, this is a picture of, I was in the play, that's me right there. Um, I was Sandy in the play, and um, it was an amazing experience. I got to meet so many new people at school. And again, I get to put myself out there, and I love singing and dancing and acting. And it was just a amazing event that I got to be a part of. And it, my favorite teacher was in charge. So the whole thing was just amazing. And I'm so glad that I got to be part of that. And I can't wait to do more like things in my life like that so as of right now I'm not really doing any plays I'm in drama again for the fourth year but I actually have a couple plays coming up but nothing like super big but yeah that's pretty much it so I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching and being a part of my fans and for watching um, I want to just say a couple thank yous to one of my boyfriend who supports me through all of this and second off, I want to thank my parents. And third off, I want to thank all my friends who have stuck around the four years of high school and that have been with me, supporting me through everything. So thank you so much for everything you guys do. And keep smiling. And while you're at it, why don't you subscribe? Um, so I'll see you guys later. Thank you. Bye.